People trust pure content first, expert content second, and vendor content last. Bringing all this content together through curation is a great way to build trust in your brand. If you look at content that, that builds trust, um, it, people trust expert, co peer content first, expert content second, and vendor content last. Uh, let's just look at an example here. If I'm looking for a restaurant where I want to go out and eat, first place I'd go is go look at my peers. I'll go to Yelp, look at you know other reviews from other uh, you know diners. The next place I'll probably go is the expert guide, like you know Zagat's or you know some maybe a, a local newspaper that talks about food reviews. The last place and the least trusted place would be maybe the testimonial section on the restaurant website. And so keeping that in mind, in order to build trust, the content can't solely be from the vendor. It can't be from the brand themselves. Some of it is, but a lot of it should also be from experts and peers and other voices aside from the brand. And to bring that all in together, uh, curation is a great way of, of doing so. In terms of curation, the way I like to think about it is um, you're adding value, not necessarily by creating content, but by um, finding, organizing, and sharing someone else's content. So if you look at uh, what a curator does in the offline world, a museum curator, um, you know, they're adding a lot of value to other people's content. They'll go find different art exhibits from around the world, uh, pull them together thematically, so you're kind of curating all about one topic. You're then organizing the content, so they're deciding how they should be hung in a gallery, how they should be lit. They're then annotating and adding meaning to the content by adding little labels in the museum. The role for a content marketer who's involved with curation is very similar. They're going finding relevant third-party content from around the web. They're focusing on a single topic. They're then organizing it, uh, making it navigable, adding their own meaning and perspective, much like a museum curator, and then sharing it to a much uh, broader audience.